What is up my breaking family? Send in some positive and very echoey vibes in your direction. We're here in downtown Indianapolis, Indiana for Pokemon Regional. And I cannot begin to tell you how excited I am. Bree is all the way over there, walking in the door, leaving me. So what we're doing this weekend is I am gonna be going around and I'm just gonna be documenting Pokemon Regionals, hanging out with people, hopefully doing some trading and talking Pokemon with all the Pokemon fans there. Woo! That was an, an excited jump. Let's do it. We have run into our first great Pokemon battle, the Escalator. I felt like I said that weird. Did I say that weird? Escalate? Escalator? It's an escalator. That sounds right, right? Yeah, okay. Right. Escalator. Okay, so we're here at check-in right here at this table. All right, so super easy check-in process. Basically, we just gave them our name and then we got our wristbands right here. That that easy. Literally took like less less than a minute. Right. Less than a minute to get in. So very, very awesome. So let's go ahead and put these on and head inside. Pokemon Regionals here in Indianapolis 2022. Take a look. So as we walk through, you'll see Pokemon signage everywhere right here, like this uh Garchomp. And then going over here, we have a Pokemon Unite game. If you feel like purchasing some Pokemon goodies, they even have a, a, a place dedicated to that. The case is stacked with ultra rares, alternate arts, rainbow rares. Oh, look at all those. We got Tomokazu artwork right there. Looking at all these goodies. There's definitely some cards in here that I need for my Pokemon card binders. Oh, Gengar Mimikyu. Up there, we got the jumbo Pokemon plush, the Pikachu, the Snorlax. We got Slowpoke over there. Look at all of those Pokemon plush. Oh, I love the ones right in the very middle. Over on the side table, we have a bunch a Pokemon sitting cuties, like this Rotom, a bunch of Deoxys, as you can see. We have a Parasect, a Lunatone. Oh, yep, Cast Form. It's so cute. Cast, well, we just had plenty of rain yesterday. We don't need any more. We need this one. No, no, no. A bunch more over here. Kecleon, Rattata. A little bit of a reflection on the case, but we got a bunch of graded Pokemon cards right here. Modern and vintage. I know the lights are right there. I apologize about that. Not much I can do. A look at all of those graded cards. Even some some first edition base set packs. I do need that Lily's full force. I might be walking out of here with that. Bunch of full art traders right here. I'm sure there's some in here that I need. Oh, we got some older ones right up there. That Colrus is really, really awesome. Ooh, shiny execute right there. Wow, there is just so much here. And of course, Marie was really excited about this. She actually has all of them except for the leafy on. And in case you need to play the trainer fresh water, we have a hydration station with Galarian Surf Edged. We have a bunch of Pokemon Center items and I absolutely love these pins right here. Oh my goodness, if there's a Psyduck, we might have to get it. So beautiful. That is a beautiful Growlithe. Oh, there's a bunch more down here. I didn't even notice it. We got Moltres, we got Pikachu. Oh, there, <laughs> there is the Psyduck right there. Oh, and a Flareon. I think we might've, uh, found our first purchase of the day. Multiple. This Psyduck pen. We have some alarm clocks, very unique. I've also been starting to drink a lot more tea, so something like that could come in handy. Everybody is battling it out right now. Whew, good luck to everybody. All right, we're battling it out. Not using a deck of mine. He was nice enough to lend us a deck here, but playing Mew, Mew VMAX. Not doing too bad so far, we just started. Yes. We just started, so. Uh, I got I got 210 on uh, Arceus V over there, so. As you can see, another round is pretty much over. Very empty right now. However, a few matches still going on. Sign in the deck box. Trying to make the signature small. <laughs> bitty, bitty. All right, there we go. Shirts are always so hard to sign. I know, right? Are you guys spectating today, playing? He played, I played, and we got a spectator doing some side events right here. He'll be Hi. playing next year. Oh, yes. You'll love it. See what Boogie Master brings in. Looks to be the better champ again. We had to take a quick stop and get some food. We got these fried green tomatoes, and oh my goodness, are they amazing. And yes, I chew gum, I put it on my plate. I know, I'm gross. I can't help it. So they just brought us a free strawberry shortcake cheesecake. Marie, how is it? So oh, so good. Deli I can tell we're, we're sharing it right now, and I think we're gonna eat the entire thing. All right. Back inside we go. Look at this big Pokemon Championship regional banter. Kanto starters right over there. We got the Alolan starters. Woo! Can you imagine if that was just like sitting in your front yard, just welcoming everybody into your house? 
and then the best Pokemon ever, Psyduck. But why did they put Psyduck all the way, all the way back here? Psyduck should be at the front, welcoming everybody. Psyduck, I apologize. Here is the prize wall, and when you win side events, you get tickets, and then you can turn the tickets in for certain prizes right here on the prize wall. We got Pokemon cards over there. We got plushies over there on that side. And if you happen to have three tickets, you can get this uh, beach ball of a master ball. As you can see, it's 8.44 p.m. and the battles are still going on. There'll be another day tomorrow and we will be back, but the night is ending. We've already had a bunch of fun. We've met a lot of awesome people. So if you stopped me and you said hi, thank you. I appreciate it very much. And I gotta say, great turnout very well ran event by round three events here. We are back for day three of Pokemon Regionals, the final day where the finalists and the champions will be crowned. And Marie, yeah. I think you're wearing my hat. I am. And that's, that's my hat. Here is the outside of the Indianapolis Convention Center. Just in case you're wondering, you wanna see what the landscape looks like everywhere, just in case you've never been here before, never visited here before. You can hear a train going by. So right as we walk in, right there, there is the entrance. They have changed the layout just a little bit. They have added these partitions. So it has cut off part of the room because it did go all the way that way, but it is day three here. So it makes sense. And we're welcomed by a Moltres. Right here in the very back of the room, you can see we came in all the way up there. In the very back of the room, this is where they're streaming. People are watching live on Pokemon's official channels. You ready? You ready? Yeah, go. All right, we're pack battling. You you got the vivid voltage. I'll go with the darkness ablaze here. Do you want me to open first or do you want to open first? Let's do it at the same time. Same time? All right. They're your pack, so you make the rules here. And whoever wins will be the best. Whoever wins will be the best. Uh-oh. I better no step up my game here. You ready? Here we go. We both got, what do we do? Energy. Energy, perfect, that's what I like to see. All right, here we go. I got a Fletchlander. Okay. Got a Flyway Bird, right? <laughs> I got a Teddy Ursa. I got Torchic over here, Trapinch, Jigglypuff. You ready? One, two, three. Oh! oh! <laughs> Rainbow Rare. Did I, did I win? Of course. Uh, of course, <laughs> <laughs> but you know what? It's your card, right? They're your pack, so you're the true winner because you get to keep the rainbow rare. Okay, so what I thought I would do here is since there is a bunch, a bunch of single cards right here, we still need probably about eight, seven more uh, ultra rares, rainbow rares, stuff like that from Cosmic Eclipse. So I'm gonna go through here and see if they have any more cards to finish out that set to get a 100% complete Cosmic Eclipse binder. So let's take a look and see what we can find. Could I please get the uh, Blastoise and Piplup Rainbow Rare? Yes, and then also the Arceus, Dialga, and Palkia Full Art. All right, I think those are the only two that I need. We're about to play in a side event and we're gonna play in this pack battle format. So you use a pack of TCG cards to create a 10 card deck, one pack. Use mutant evolution rules to evolve a basic into any stage one or VMAX and a stage one into any stage two. Never run out of cards. Shuffle your discard pile if you run out of your deck. So this is gonna be really interesting. I've never done this format before, but we're gonna give it a try be interesting one pack how cool are these little tickets yeah those are the the side event tickets right there and they're see-through yeah they're like see-through the awesome staff is leading us to the pack battle right now hopefully you can hear us it's a little loud in here who hasn't done pack battle me <laughs> all right you gotta put a 10 card deck all basic energies are rainbow energies all bases give vault to any stage one any stage one give vault to any stage two also, any basic ball to any V Star or V Max. Okay, so here's the one pack that we're building a deck out of. Literally, we're gonna use every card from this pack. So let's go ahead and uh, open this up. Ugh. All right, here is our pack. Let's see what we ended up getting to play in our pack battle format here. Oh, that's a that's a good card there. <laughs> 
We got an energy, we got magma basin, hip on top. And there is the code card. So this is literally our deck right here. Literally our deck. So here is my 10 card deck. We got these Pokemon and then all energies. I think I think I should be fine. Got 120 damage and then a hundred damage right there. So, and there's one prize card. You literally just have to knock out one Pokemon. So one prize card, you draw four cards for your starting hand and that's, uh, that's it. All right, so we ended up tying for first place. I won against everybody here, except, except for you, you beat me. <laughs> but we ended up tying for first place, both of us. So we both got tickets right here for the prize wall. Ugh, all the way back there. Okay, we enjoyed the pack battle format so much that we instantly got back in line and decided to do another one. So we are, the judge is leading the way. And now we're heading over here to another free table to pack battle once again. This is seriously so much fun. Trying to trying to document my whole experience here on camera so you all can join with me. Trying to give you a point of view of everything that's going on. I'll take the leftover one, thank you. All right, let's see what is all inside of our booster pack here. Chimchar, we had that one last time. Uh-oh, we got some goodness down there. We got a trainer gallery with that Flareon right there. And a Tornado's looking strong. And we got our V-Star, we got Barry, Staravia, and a Gloria. So I definitely think we can play that Flareon in the deck there. Our game is already over. I ended up winning, but their game is still going on. Coin flip. It's intense over here. We got Moltres down there. Uh-oh, uh-oh. <laughs> Resistance. Back to pack battling again. And this time, our buddy Mikey is playing. We got Mikey about to lose. Please. <laughs> Please. Pack battle tournament number three. Opening up our... <laughs> Don't laugh. <laughs> oh. oh, nice. Boom. There we go. We got Piplup. We got Turtwig. All the starters here this time around. Like the Buzz. Alucha. Heatran. Oh, rainbow rare. Beautiful. Nice. Okay, cool. Cool. So far, every pack battle we've done, we've pulled something. There's the code card. I don't think that Kindler's going to help me out too much, but we're going to head and uh, build a deck out of this. Maybe that whole Lucha. All right, so first round, Marie was my opponent. And we won. just played, and uh, luckily I won with my Heatran. No, 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 absolutely not. You lost. I won with my Heatran uh -uh. right no, here, so no, uh, round not. one to me. No. And then a loss no, to, to you. Lost. To you. I won my Jolteon, so you need to get it straight. Eh. Don't you, eh. This looks like an intense game over here. <laughs> it looks like a real game at this moment. Right. <laughs> what is Mikey gonna do? All right, we got the battle of the century right here. Real Breaking Eight versus Mikey right oh, over there. Yeah. Oh, we've been waiting years for this. <laughs> years for this. We, we've built up our decks for the past, I don't know, five years at this point. Yeah, we've been- Five we've, years? Five years, uh, five or, years. Or five minutes. I, I think years sounds better. Okay, five years. Five years we've been working on our decks right here, <laughs> and it's all come down to this moment. Good luck. Good luck. All right, I'm gonna go. Brandon Gallery got No way. No mutant at all. No way. All right. Explosive bolt. Four thirty. We'll evolve into crawl nut. Okay. I'm gonna do crab impact for 150. You don't have a water. They, they told us that the energy's cast. Oh, rainbows? Yeah. Really? Dude, we were running so low on energy, so we just like. Oh! <laughs> so I wasn't wrong about it. Well, no, 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 no. But now you guys are having just a who can pull the better card pack battle situation with fusion strike and then chilling rain, chilling rain over here. Are we doing four or are we doing four what, and two? Uh, I did four and two. It doesn't matter. What is it doesn't okay. matter. All right. Let's see what you got first here. Going into an uh, EV. <laughs> we got that Shinx. Beware. Growlithe. And a Zara Aura. All right. Your turn over here. All you have to do is just be a regular rare. <laughs> And, and an Eevee, I guess. We got Lucky Energy. And... Oh, no. oh! I don't know who wins here. 
It might just might be a tie, honestly. Okay, so we have three tickets to turn into the prize wall right over here. So let's uh, see what we can get for three tickets. Please have a beach ball, yes. Yeah. Thank you so much. No problem, thank you so much for coming and playing. They are about to start game three between these two competitors. Which one is gonna take home that win? All weekend for the TCG, it has come down to this. Indianapolis Pokemon Regionals is almost over. They're playing the final game right up there. They have started to take down a lot of the signs. That's another successful regionals. This one was massive. This one was absolutely packed. And I, I gotta say, I've been to I've been to some regionals in my day, and I feel like this is one of the biggest ones ever. I mean, it was absolutely massive. It was very, very well ran by round three events. Breaking family, I want to say how happy I was to meet a bunch of fans of the channel while I was at Pokemon Regionals and what really, really just warmed my heart overall was to see so many people enjoying Pokemon together and that made my heart so happy. And I want to give a huge shout out and thank you to Round 3 Events who put on this amazing Pokemon Regionals event in Indianapolis, Indiana, and who granted me a media pass for the weekend. So a big thank you to Round 3 Events. It was literally one of those situations where I did not want the weekend to end. Breaking family, that's it for today's Pokemon video. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Check out those videos right over there. I'll see you all in the next video. And don't forget, I love every single one of you all around the world. Do it with me now. Peace, love, and a high five.